And tonight's a new plan to arm teachers with the vaccine. News Force Kaitor K has more on money that is now being offered to get it. $1,000, that's what Putnam City Schools is offering employees who get the COVID vaccine. A district spokesperson says the $3.2 million in federal funding going towards these stipends is money well spent. I'm really glad that they're doing that and incentivizing their teachers and staff to get it. Here's one parent of a Putnam City student who supports the district paying employees to get the COVID vaccine. Megan Scott's second grader goes to Arbor Grove. Because my kid can't be vaccinated, so the only way to protect her is to have masks in place, have social distancing, and everyone else around her be vaccinated who can be. The district now offering a one-time $1,000 stipend to any full-time or part-time worker that gets the shot by October 1st. District spokeswoman Kathleen Kennedy says the reasoning is clear-cut. To provide a safer environment for those who are most vulnerable, who cannot or or have not been able to get that vaccine. Also this week, the district updating the language in their back to school plan, which now says anyone inside a Putnam school building is expected to wear a mask, whether there are students, teachers, staff, or visitors. Expectation is a stronger wording that we can use rather than we would like you to wear a mask. But some parents think stronger changes could have been made. We wish that they would have a requirement. However, Kennedy says it's against state law for them to mandate masks. But we can set expectations, and this is another expectation, so that we can have a very good quality education this year. To help the district with its struggle to hire substitute teachers, they're also offering a stipend of up to $1,000 to subs. Since the announcement was made on Monday, 13 people have applied for those positions.